Get over here! Good. Do you want to send uh, the Lagoos over here just in case? Maybe they can do something? God, what I wouldn't give for a rescue right about now. Um. Yeah, unfortunately, she's going to take a hit. Hopefully it's not enough, but given her defense and that 20 HP, honestly, like, this is the best we got, dude. Soren would have been better at tanking it. Yes, but I don't want to take chances with Soren with a... With a, uh... Okay, here's a question. Can Soren reach to attack that soldier? No. No, okay. Alright, then, yes, this is the best that we have. Um, if we move over to... Let, let's clean up the other side. Yeah. And before you use Ike... Try and make a command. Alright. Well, let's clean up first here. Yeah. Okay, that mage is going to attack someone if we put someone in that range. So, um... First of all... Mia, see what you can do. Look at that! Okay. The increase in strength and speed! Yeah, that's not awful. Speed is something that Mia always excels in, but str mm -hmm. strength is the part that's tough. Yeah. And her weapon level takes a while to get out <clears> where you need it. But we got that, okay. so uh, we need to take out this soldier. So how about Oscar? Cantos back and forth? Can't. You can't reach. Not even with a uh, javelin? Nope. Then it's got to be Ike. Yep. Yeah. yeah, Ike can tank a thunder, a thunder yeah. spell, but yeah. before we do that, direct. What do we want to do with these? Uh, tell them to target over where everybody else is. Like, even, like, target Wait, them. Let me check something. Hmm. If you can get Leaf up there, they might prioritize attacking Leaf. All right, then. We shall try. Okay, so let's go here. Direct. Target. Right over here. Alright. Moment of truth. Oh boy. This is not good. This is not good. This is not good. We put ourselves in a bad position here. I was thinking... See, I was afraid if we let them catch up to us that they would interfere with Marcia. Mm -hmm. Which would be the case, but we kind of put ourselves in a bit of, uh, in a bit of danger here. It... If I could change it, I would have also sent Ike back there. Mm. And I thought the... Um, yeah, that's a safe heal. Now I'm going to use a ward. Okay. It's a little more experience for something that's not going... That we're not going to use all too often. Okay, and um... Yeah, Soren, stay there to help clean things up. Uh, I'd say Titania, just leave her right there. Yeah. Alright, get over there, Leaf. Good girl. Nope, go for it. See, this is my problem with Shade. You never know when it's gonna actually work. Oh, uh, that's pretty clutch. Iliana! She was already going to survive, but she was like, screw this, you're dead. Iliana! Atta girl. That clutch crit, that clutch level up. That's a great level up, dude. Up oh man, you scared me there, girl, but you did it. Was that from the from the water? From the pure water? I think so. <laughs> Magic Tank Boyd is my new favorite thing. Oh my god. Next to Vengeful Iliana. Meanwhile, uh, Ike is fast enough to dodge lightning bolts. 
right. Oh my god. Okay. Marcia, don't be a hero. Fly to Ike. Fly to Ike. I feel so much better Good now. Good job. Okay. Pirates. <laughs> uh. Yar har ho. Scallywags of the sea are we. We fight like beasts and men do flee. We earn our gold with axes bold. Yar, you scurry bilge rats, why aren't you singing? Alright, over there, Nadata. Fix your eyes on that. Do you see what I see? Oh, ho, ho. what's this then? Humans battling humans here in Galia. What in the briny beard of Shanty Pete is going on? Oi, do you think that may be the king's curse out to capture us and claim the bounty? <laughs> Shall we unfurl the mainsail and steer for calmer waters? Bite your tongue, you kelp brained idiot! We're pirates! We don't turn tail from government scum! I'm going ashore! Watch me and you'll see a true sea dog in action! Yeah, well said! You set me blood bo shoot you set me blood a boil. I'm with you all the way, matey. Arr, let's see what we can see then. Yeah, my axe is sharp and my spirit is bold. Yaha ho! Yoha! What the fuck is this? They're fun. <laughs> is that basically the equivalent of those like ridiculous looking like big lip pirates that are like bandits that we see in every game? Yeah, I guess that's the closest thing. I don't I don't remember another situation so where that is. Yeah, here we have Nadata. Um if you check their movement up there, uh they're gonna move really slow for a turn or two. But we want but we then, do not want them reaching there. But then they're gonna wreck stuff, so Alright then. Then let's do some work. Yeah. Mia Not quite. <clears throat> not quite. Fine, then we'll do this. Because Oscar can't kill anything. Yeah. <laughs> He's really tanky, but... Ugh. I feel like this version of Oscar we have here is just like a very, very gentle soul. He is... He is a gentle soul, though. He is all around the um, tankiest of the Cavaliers in this game, mm -hmm. generally. Alright, then we, we can have a Reese heal Oscar up. Yep. But, um... Titania should try and get over there to... Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're gonna have Titania on uh, house duty here. Not that kind of house duty. Yeah. Oh, and, um... Try and have Ike send the cats somewhere nearby here, too, just to, just to help. Mm-hmm. Because when the pirates show up, it'll be nice to have the cats nearby. Uh, if for nothing else, than to draw aggro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, can't tell. So direct. Actually, I'm going to move him over here just in case. Um, uh, direct. Aggro. Target. Yeah, move him up here to the beach. I'd say uh, about, like north of where Reese is. Perfect. Darn dodgy Myrmidons. It's all good. We got it. Yeah, we've had our thing spread out all around. I'm actually not sure who the MVP for this chapter is going to be. Don't worry, Soren knows. 15 Ranger! When did that happen? Not a good level up, but still. Yeah. Alright, and we have uh, Reese heal up Oscar. Uh... Yeah, Marcia can reach Ike from there, so yeah, yeah, yeah. she'll go... And once... The good, the good thing is that once she does, um, then we can have her rush over here. Yeah, okay, so real quick before you move Rolf, uh, move down and check on that guy there, because he'll, he'll, he'll get you. <laughs> yeah, good call. You, you put Rolf in the wrong place and you regret it. Mm-hmm. Um... Yeah, and right. then I think it's going to have to be Boyd killing that mage because these two aren't going to do very much to him. Damn. Even with the hammer, the slow the slow hammer, he can still like one-shot this dude. Yeah. 
Um, I am curious to at least see what they can do. By my estimation, it's going to be very little. Oh, 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 okay, okay. No, not really. Sure. We have Soren, we can uh, soften him up, have Ileana finish him off. Okay. And we have Mist to heal up Ileana right before that. Unless, like, Soren decides to either Adept or Crit. Nope. Alright. I'm satisfied with how all that went. Yeah. Ileana scared me for a moment, but... Whew. You know what? I never checked this. Um, you have Miracle. Yeah. So, I want to make a correction with something that I said before. Um, in this game, in Path of Radiance, you cannot remove skills. I mean, yeah. if you do, it destroys the skill. You can't remove it and give it to somebody else. Yes, I do remember someone commenting on I that. I think in Radiant Dawn you can. So, I mean, thank you comment sections for helping us keep these things straight. Yeah, it's a good thing that we also didn't make any rash decisions as a result of that. Yeah. Like, I guess, that, like... This is why I never do anything too quickly, because there's always a chance that I might be an idiot. Mm -hmm. It also does make sense that you can at least remove them, because if you have an unfavorable skill on someone that you don't think is benefiting them yeah. too much, then you can just kind of, like, say, nah, screw it. Like, for example, if you're not comfortable with Boyd having Tempest, that's, uh... Yeah. Like, that, that... Tempest in and of itself is a gamble. I kind of like Tempest, though, because it makes for some glorious moments. Hey, dude, Boyd's been doing work, so... Yeah. Um... You're gonna be tempted to send Boyd south? Yeah, no, but I'm Don't. gonna have... Don't. I'm gonna have him, uh... I'm gonna have him, uh, join the rest. Yeah. So, I'll tell you the last major quirk of this, which is that when you get close to the keep, a bunch of reinforcements come out of the keep. Good to know. Okay, one of you is in range. What do we got here? We got a thunder spell. Oh, 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 oh but I thought you were one of the Holy Pegasus Knights of Benyon. <laughs> I resigned. So what do you say? Are you going to let me in or what? Come on! Are you sure about this? I mean, I'll be honest with you, we're a destitute band of mercenaries. Your wages will be a pittance compared to what you're used to. So what? Are you saying no? No, I'm simply pointing out that you'll be losing almost all of- <laughs> I won't lose out on anything. Plus, I'll work twice as hard as anyone else. Come on! Please let me join! Please? Well, if that's what you want, I guess we'll give it a shot. We're short-handed, though, so you're going to be busy. Huzzah! That's great! Just tell me what he's doing! And we have Marcia! Yeah, we got a flyer! Woo! Marcia, the first Pegasus Knight in the game, equipped with a javelin and a slim lance, uh, for some reason has does not have Kanto. Though I think as a as a flyer unit, you have it anyway. No, yeah, like, she does have Kanto. Like, she just, it doesn't show. Like, if you look on Oscar, it won't show him having Kanto either. Really? I thought he did. No, you're right. Huh. Oh, yeah, you know what? Neither does Titania. For some reason, I thought they did. But yeah, no, any mounted unit has Kanto in this game, and Pegasus Knights uh, fall into that. So you know what, Mia? Yeah, we're going to put you to use immediately. Wait a minute. Yeah, I mean, you can attack that mage on your way. <laughs> uh, can we check the movement on these pirates? Uh, yes. Perfect. Yeah, man. So, um... <laughs> Marcia is another great candidate for bonus XP. Yeah, because, like, she also tends to be pretty decent, right? She tends to get pretty decent. It helps that she can fly, but she needs some help. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, she's, she's starting out as a level 5 um, uh, Pegasus Knight. But Basically, let's go ahead and fix that a little bit right now. Yeah, I, I liken her to Mia in that she just does not have the damage she needs. But she flies and lances are better weapons yeah. than swords in this game. Yeah, you are correct. J just fat. And once we get her promoted... 
she's pretty darn good. But flyers in this game are just wonderful. All right. I'm going to do something a little bit dumb, but not too dumb. Okay. Not not dumb as in, like, this is going to put anyone in any sort of danger. Oh. Oh, okay. You see what I'm doing, right? Yeah. It, it's silly. <laughs> that was a little bit silly. Um, Just making sure. Okay. Here's a thought. Uh, yeah. Would you want to have Oscar and... Oh, okay. Alright. Oh, did, did, what did you think I was doing? I didn't think you were doing anything else, but uh, yeah, that's fine. Alright. Um, I'm honestly fine having Oscar, maybe. Uh, no, that's a steel axe. Nada Nadata hits hard, though. Like, be ready for that up, up in the north. Oh, yeah. Um, Nadata does hit hard. He is a level... Oh, I just realized he's a level 18 bandit! Yeah. Level 10, level 10. Jesus! I mean... Well, yeah, he's not going to reach anyone right now. Yeah. But, good lord, thank you for warning me about that. Also, uh, those aren't the only pirates. Oh. So, I'm All glad right. I'm glad you moved somebody to intercept, though. Like, that's nice. Yeah, because, like, no one else is going to be able to reach a Mia. Yeah. Just that one, so we... Oh, that's a hand axe. Oh, so that doesn't... This actually doesn't work at all. Mother Pfeiffer! Okay. All right, then. Uh, let's get uh, everybody else up here. Mm -hmm. Though, if we're lucky, he'll attack one of the cats instead. Yeah, I'm thinking that, too. Honestly, like, I doubt that hand axe is going to hit Mia anyway, but still, better safe than sorry, you know? Not uh, likely to hit, less likely to kill. Yes. You get that experience missed. Mm-hmm. We're gonna need it for you. Uh, it sucks too because she starts as a level one cleric this far, like this far into the game. Yeah. And it's like the stabs only heal one per. So like me thinking the first time I played this game, like, oh well, Reese is already like this, this well trained. You know, I'm just gonna have Reese be my healer. Um, n no. I mean, you can do both, but train up missed. Mm-hmm. All right, so this guy's gonna start doing some work here. Yeah, yeah, he is. Uh. Hmm. Also, check. Um. Okay, so he's not quite gonna reach that house, so we can safely move Marcia. You're from Crimea, aren't you? I'm a warrior of the Beast Tribe. Lord Runolf spoke of you. Doubtless, you have noticed that Fort Tatana has been taken by Dayan forces. Watch your step around that bunch. There's a dangerous mage within them. We, we of the Beast Tribe find magic, and especially fire magic, particularly threatening. I am waiting for friends and cannot take my leave of this house, but I would give you this. If you, can, if you use it, your magical resistance will increase. It will help you fight that mage. Take care. Pure water? A <laughs> talisman! Better than pure water. Even better! How about that? Alright then. So, um... He's got that Venom Axe. Honestly, I'm, I'm more than willing to have Ike take this. Yeah. Move him over here so that uh, he's the only one. I'm going to direct. What? Do, where do we want to direct them? Um. Well, do you want to keep them towards or away from... I'm thinking maybe try and put them on the other side of Ike. Like over there. Here? Yeah. In that case, if we need to, we can collapse them in on the, on the group. Yeah. And your item is going to be... Hmm. Might as well use the rest of that steel sword, huh? Or that iron sword, huh? Sure, yeah. All right, then. Then let's move everyone else out of the way. Now, keep in mind, when you move these guys, it's going to give the other guy more room to move. So, make sure you move them real far away. Ah, ah. You can do that, yeah. Yeah, let's uh, put me over here. Make sure that no one else is behind him. Okay, no, we're good. Nope, nope. Nope, 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 n
Alright. A couple of scary moments here and there, but this chapter is going pretty well now. Yeah, I don't... I don't usually send everybody north. I was just thinking, oh, it'll be easier if we just send everybody north. I didn't think it through all the way that, like, oh, those other guys would follow us and then they'd be in Marcia's way. Mm -hmm. I'm going to... No, you know what? I'd rather put Reese over here. Like, I don't want to put... I don't want to risk having him suddenly, like, get surrounded. Yeah. Um, boy, you need healing, actually. And actually, this will serve me well, because I think I'm going to put Boyd in the line of fire. Oh, no, wait, no, they're probably gonna, they're probably gonna end up attacking, uh... Oh, no, the, the cats are gonna move. The cats are gonna move. Yeah, so you know what? I am going to put, I'm going to leave Boyd here, equipped with the hand axe. Uh, could you also shove Reese back one more space? I feel a lot better if... You're not wrong. Because um, once the cats move, I don't know if that's gonna let hand axe man yeah, move a little I bit Yeah, I am going to let Titania, um... Uh, put Titania over here, uh, in case we need her to do some emergency, uh, emergency offense. Actually, I'm a little afraid about what Hand Axe Man is gonna do now that the cat's moved. Um, he shouldn't be able to move much. He shouldn't be able to, I'm just, I'm just trying to make sure I'm not forgetting something. Yeah. Good work, Mia! Mia, if you keep doing that, you might be a pretty decent Myrmidon. Okay, no, he's attacking Ike. <laughs> All right, moment of truth. Yo ho, -ho. huh? Yo ha ha! What a ragged bunch! Scallywags of the sea are we. Will not lose to the likes of thee. Ooh! Yeah, this is, um... Ooh, 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 ooh. Wasn't expecting that dodge. So we're gonna... Oof. There's a lot of bad happening right now. Okay. Oh, wow. This guy's actually pretty damn strong. Yeah. Oh, shoot. Okay. So, here are my thoughts. First, right. first, can we get a movement on all of the pirates? All, all five of them. And Nadata. Okay, so number one, let's have the mages on the right take out that one that Mia's fighting. Whichever, whichever ones can. Um, or maybe Rolf. Perfect, well done. Mm-hmm. Uh, use Gust. Keep working on his, uh... On his, his wind, his wind uh, On his wind, uh, attrib attribution. So this frees Mia up in case we need another body over there. You're right. Yeah, I didn't realize how strong Nadata was. Yeah, um... Good level up, Soren. I mean... Well, is it gonna be a good level up? Not bad. Yeah. Didn't get the magic I wanted, but skill is also very good on him. Mm -hmm. Okay, um... So make sure when it's Ike's turn that you set him to roam. Uh, that, that you set the cats to roam so mm -hmm. that they can attack some of these axemen. Um... One way or another, we need to get Nadata out of here. Yeah, we also need to get to that house over there. Mia's, or Marcia's got that. Yeah, but then she's gonna get attacked. No, Kanto. Oh, cool, cool, cool. Yeah, she Kantos and then she goes into the cliffs. Yeah, okay. Do you want to do that first? Uh, yeah, be very careful about how you do it, but yeah. Eek! He, he, human! Ah! Um... <laughs> so rude if you can't tell i'm playing dead so go away huh why because my mother told me if you ever meet a look uh oh uh, why because my mother told me if you ever meet a bayork play dead and it will leave you be it's not true is it <sighs> i knew it wasn't true i knew it well then take this and get out of here quickly i hate humans i don't want to talk to you Shoo! 
Well, that was rude. We gotta restore staff out of it. I mean, she thinks we're breaking into her house and we're on a weird winged horse. Mm-hmm. Um... So... If we could... Okay, take the movement off of the three. Let's just see the movement of the two that are in the water. Okay, so... Um... Put the movement back on the guy on the left. Let's get his movement sphere back again. Cool. I think I see what you're getting at. So we can kind of make a wall of units for Nadata and Handaxe guy. Mm -hmm. um, if Boyd could kill Handaxe guy, that would be fantastic. Can he? But... Okay, before you do that... Yeah, that 50% though. Why don't we have Titania attack Handax guy and then Kanto one space down to be next to Nadata, to block Nadata. Mm-hmm. Do That's it. our best bet. Do it. Do it. <laughs> Good. Nice work, Titan uh, Titania. Okay, so now we don't have to wor worry about range units anymore. Mm-hmm. Also, we could just keep Titania right there, have Void attack Nadata, and I think we should be able to move healers in to heal people attacking Nadata without Nadata getting to them. Mm-hmm. Um, oh no, he can move around that. Never mind. But uh, not entirely. His movement is still restricted because of the sand. Yeah. So if we move Ike here, that shouldn't actually make a difference at all. Well, one way or another. But I mean, I, like I want to put yeah. him there. Some I want to put him there one way or the other. How far can Oscar move? Just for my peace of mind. Um, not very far. What What does Mia versus Nadata look like? Good, good call. Oh, she like she'll be able to dodge him pretty damn easily, and even then, she uh, he's not fast enough to hit her twice. Okay, so I'm gonna say, don't worry about attacking with Mia. Um, just kind of plant her there. Let me check something. Okay, so if she has the iron sword equipped. He's not gonna be able to do much. Yeah. Okay. So keep her there. I think so. Yeah. And his movement, boom. All right. So then Ike. Direct roam. Yeah. Release the tires. And also can attack. Yep. I say we plant him. Hear me out. Okay. I doubt that Venonax is going to hit him, but if it does, it's poisonous. Okay, we can plant him. I say we plant him. With that Regal Sword. The Regal Sword gives him the best chance of dodging and the best chance of dealing some decent damage should he not, should he hit. Yeah, okay. And in that case, yep. Um, and if we want, we could also move Boyd in so that Titania is not taking two attacks. Two attacks uh, from uh, what? Yeah, she's not taking two attacks no matter what. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, but we could also move Boyd into health next turn. All right. Move him over here? Yeah. All right. And then move healers and range units in to help clean up. Yeah. What I'm wondering is what the uh, what the cats are going to do should those uh, should they decide to attack Nadata. Um. I'm honestly hoping they don't kill him. Yeah, me too. But that's, we shall see. That's not that's preferable to them dying. Well, that's one that's not. Oh, okay, okay, all right. That's good. That's good actually. I'm okay with this. You might go after Leaf. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yar, beasties! No need to panic. Try to hit them while they're in human form. Thieving worms, prepare to die! Alright, and Leaf can't counterattack because she's not in human form. Yeah, they can counterattack in their human form in Radiant Dawn, can't yeah, they? Yeah, in Radiant Dawn, everybody can counterattack, basically. Like, even healers can, like, whack somebody with the staff, which mm -hmm, I think is mm -hmm. pretty funny. Oh, you guys are moving all these places I don't like. Okay. Um, can we check the movement of the guy in the middle? Cool. Um, so maybe Ilyana can team up with somebody. Yeah. And we can try and range spam this guy. Do you want to go with Elf Thunder or do you want to just use Thunder? Let's see who else can hit him first. Uh, how does Oscar do against him? 
Probably not much. Probably not much, but... If we use a Steel Lance... Eh, maybe. What about Rolf? He's got a guaranteed 7 hit. So 7... And 11 makes 18. Or we can just use Boyd. Um, well, that's gonna be 32. That's not gonna kill, but... It that's not gonna kill, but that gives someone else the opportunity to kill. Yeah, go for it. Lovely. Who do we want to give the kill to? Um, I'll let you pick. There's a lot of good candidates. Um, let's see. Mia could. Mia cannot do it. Honestly, why don't we give it to Rolf? I'm fine with that. Excellent. If this wasn't an Iron Man run, I would just pick my units that I wanted to use. Mm -hmm. Because then you're restarting even if they die. Yeah. And then I wouldn't bother with Rolf. But since we don't know who's going to live or die, it kind of helps to have your eggs in different baskets. Yeah. All right, then. <sighs> okay. So let's, uh... Let's work on Nadata a little bit. Honestly, like, given the numbers that we saw before, I'm willing to let uh, Ike and Mia handle him. And in fact, Reese, just in case. Do it for the experience. Mostly. Alright, we're gonna put Ike here. Okay. Because what's gonna happen is that the uh, beast units are going to surround him. Yeah. Okay. I want to see what they can do first, so yeah. I think I'm going to wait. Okay, check Nadata's movement, because right now I think he's going for Reese. But if we move him here, with the Iron Sword, boom. Okay, and uh, Titania, I mean, you can, you can completely surround Nadata if you want, or you can um, move her... Uh, no, she won't be able to reach. Okay, then... Uh... What I'm going to do is I'm going to rescue Reese and get him out of here. Just in case. Okay, I move Soren and Ilyana closer to the gang. Yeah. Does anyone need a healing? Uh, I mean, you could heal Soren or Titania. Let's do Titan. Let's do Titania. Yeah, they don't need it, but it's experience. Experience for, for Mist. experience for Miss. That's what we need, dude. One way or the other. And we can buy healing stabs later. Okay. <laughs> do you want to javelin the Donna just for the just for the kicks? Do you want to try? Yeah, it'll be fun. I am going to move her back into the cliffs though, because if those beast units move in a way that oh, we don't want. Oh, you're right. Want... Hmm, okay. Yeah. Scallywags of the sea, are we? We earn our gold with axes bold. One XP. And thanks to Kanto. Boom. Scallywags are the, the, the C or we, and Marcia, she gets one XP. <laughs> <laughs> oh! They are fools. I will punish you. Damn! Okay, he's gonna attack Leaf. Uh huh. This is good. This is all good. These are all good things that are happening. Yes. All right, Boyd, mess him up. I'll show you how to use an axe. Take notes, buddy. Oh, perfect. All right. I doubt you're resistant to magic all that much. Yeah. Now here's the question. Who do we want killing him? Uh For the growth's sake, I say Mia. For the sake of getting him to max as fast as possible, I say Ike. I mean, I'm always gonna say Ike. I'm always gonna say Ike over Mia. Now 
Just for the hell of it. Yeah. Who knows? She might hit. <laughs> there's, some, there's some free experience for you, Marcia. Yeah. And she can Kanto out of there. Yeah, let's do it. Okay, cool. Uh, iron? Yeah. And you know what? If you somehow miss this Ike, then Mia can kill him. Scallywags of the sea are we. An end like this is quite worthy. Aww. We hardly a, war knew. <laughs> a warrior to the end. Okay, that was a little stressful, but goodness. Sailing off out. to Valhallar. Ugh, no. Yeah, so let's uh, take care of this uh, fine young gentleman here. Poke. Feathered. <laughs> <laughs> you just got feathered. Uh, <laughs> All right, Rolf. You got I am Rolf. Son of a shepherd. <laughs> Strength and speed, I'll take it. <laughs> Who knows, maybe Rolf Boyd and Oscar were raised by shepherds. We don't know. Um, there might actually be an answer to that already, but... I All know... Right. Um, their father died of illness, and their mother ran out on them. Yeah. Well, at this point, we can kind of just, like, move forward yeah. now. I don't think we're going to get too much, like, bonus XP out of this, but, eh. I'm uh, not going to complain about the results here. Yep. Uh, while Oscar is moving units, I also want to address that, um... Oh, I th you were talking about me, not this Oscar. <laughs> while Oscar is moving forward, um... While Oscar is moving Oscar... <laughs> uh, one thing I want to address from a previous episode is that we said that maybe it was hinted at that... That's right. Uh... Uh, Titania. Tati Titania. I can keep thinking of Tatiana, your D and D character. Sorry. Titania and Grail maybe were hinted to have some kind of romantic relationship. Excellent um, level up, by the apparently way. Apparently, in her A support with Ike, which I don't think I've ever actually gotten because I don't usually run to Tanya. Um, but it is confirmed that she had romantic feelings for Grail. Yeah, they never actually had a relationship like that. But uh, yes, uh, Titania. I, I think Titania did have uh, a thing for Grail. Yeah, I think she would be willing, but Grail wouldn't be. Yeah, uh, because you know Grail was already married, and he uh, has two kids. So what are you gonna do yeah. there? I mean, I mean, his wife, his wife was dead by the time he met Titania. Yeah, but, but Titan Titania respects. Um, uh, Titania respects. Uh, yeah, they're poisoned. Uh, Titania respects Grail enough to know that hey, like I may have these feelings for him, but. There's no way I could take that away from him. Oh. Idea. Okay. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I was actually going to suggest that. She can't... Oh, wait. Can she? Can you? No. no she can't. No. Um. Well, she can at least do this. Yeah. I tried. You I really could tried. use that, though, to have her heal them every turn. And just kind of create a little, uh, mist training funnel. You're not wrong. They're gonna move like crazy. Oh, well, no, well, I can... You, you can, can tell them not to move like crazy. Yeah, I'll halt them. Yeah, it's always going to say... St you always, like, when you see staff, you're like, Ooh, who can I heal? But... If you have a ward staff. It's always going to be a case it's of always next to someone, yeah. yeah. Yeah, you can always ward somebody. Alright, there we go. Yeah, so, um... So here's another idea I have. Yeah? Um... Uh, wait till next turn, though, but, um... Yeah, have, have Boyd bait them. Yeah. And then... I, I think this forest here is where we can make our stand for the reinforcements that are going to show up. It's going to be like two soldiers and two swordsmen are going to drop in. Oh, really? We're going to get ambushed here? Oh, uh, they're going to come out of the castle. Ah, okay. Gotcha. Because I am a seer. 
I can see the future. You looked it up. <laughs> I, I played it, is what I did. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we can just have, like, uh, Mist kind of just continuously heal them. You have lived one life. I have lived many. <laughs> I am a gamer, not because I don't have a life, but because I choose to have many. One of my favorite quotes, by the way. Uh, so yeah, Boyd here. Yep. Uh, you can give him the hammer if you want. Um, I'm gonna give him a hand axe, actually. Oh, makes that, sense, archers. Because that archer's going to, going to strike. Orchers. And you know what? Yeah, we're gonna go with, uh, the, uh, actual, um, thunder and lightning here. <laughs> the axual? Ugh, s screw off. So, um, yeah, we just... Be prepared to backtrack... But we might be able to just hold this point. You said swordsmen, right? Uh, swordsmen and soldiers. Okay. Then... Definitely get Ike up there. Where? I mean, to where everybody else is. Okay. Because if you said backtrack, then I don't I don't know if I want to keep Mist here with these two just standing there. Oh, no, you can start... You can start moving people up. Well, no. Are they... Are, is she in danger if she stays here? Oh, no. Absolutely not at all. Okay. That, that's they're, what I was worried they're about. They're going to come out of the keep, out of the front of the keep where we're going right now. Ah, They will not you. be able to get past our guys. Okay. Good to know. Just wanted to be sure. I... I yeah. Because you said, like, out of the castle. I was like, okay, where out of the castle? I, I commend your caution. But yeah, this is basically just going to be experience fodder for Mist. Yep. So I'm not going to complain. Now this uh, this keep is also kind of a tough egg to crack. Uh huh. To, to use one of my favorite strategy phrases. Do it again. Uh, do it again. Oh. Ah, oh, you know what? That's fine. Yeah. That gives uh, someone else a chance. Yeah, I guess. I'm and that's a level up. Kind of happy about that actually. Got some HP, got some strength, strength, and speed. Got some speed. Would have liked some more skill, but eh, what are you gonna do? Oh no, big metal guy, what am I gonna do? Oh, I know, I'm gonna hit it. That's gonna leave him with one charge of the hand axe left? Yeah. Because he missed? He swung, and he missed. I swung, and I missed. Okay, I'm curious here. Hmm, not quite. Uh, keep an eye on the other archer that's still down there, too. Thank you for letting me know. I'm actually gonna get a rain get a beat on him. Uh, if Oscar... Oh, I was gonna say, if Oscar cantos in and out, and then Marcia could probably finish the archer off. Uh-huh. Do it, yeah, sure. Yeah, why not? Flippin' sure. So I guess we're running Mia now. I guess. I, I guess, mean, I guess that's doing, something that's She's happening. doing work. Maybe not the greatest work. Let's see how this level up fares. Eyes are on you, Mia. Hmm, uh, not great. 